This is an interesting question that has a graph for work done by gas or on gas. So you have a fixed amount of gas, a bunch of changes happen to its pressure and volume. P and V is changing. So you see, wow, here become here, go to here. It's a cycle. Like, it's called a gas cycle. In two of the changes, no work is done. Mm. In one change, work is done by the gas on the surrounding. In another change, work is done on the gas by the surrounding. Huh? Okay, okay. Let's slow down first. There's no work done at two stages. Where does that happen? Maybe you want to think first, okay, work done is what? Uh? Pressure of the gas. I mean... We don't know whether piston, okay, never mind. We just put pressure times change in volume. If there is a change in volume, then there will be work done. So you see, oh, which one don't have change in volume? Ah, yeah, you see this one from uh, point one, no, la, let's call this in transition one, there is no work done. And this is transition two, and this is transition three, and transition four. Transition 3 also no work done on gas or by gas. Then it boils down to 3 and 4. Uh, 2 and 4. They ask us to find work done on gas by surrounding. That is extremely important. Cool. You want to highlight or underline that. Work done on the gas by the surrounding. So if work is done on the gas by surrounding, it's like... The outside compresses the gas and it becomes smaller. So when it's work done on gas, really you want to see the volume decrease. And that's our convention. So we need to look between two, transition 2 and 4, which one the volume decrease? You look and see. Lor. I, oh, this one is, the number 2 is volume increase. So that is work done by gas. No, that's not the answer we want to find. So therefore... Our final choice here, we're going to use number four. This is work done on the gas because you decrease volume from five all the way down to two. Mm. So this is a volume decrease. So you can find pressure, which is constant, one times 10 to the five times the change in volume. What's the change in volume? 5 minus 2. Positive or negative doesn't mind, right? Yeah, at this stage doesn't mind. AS, you don't care. So you just take the change in volume. Okay, 5 minus 2. You can do 2 minus 5. That's fine with me too. So this will be 10 to the negative 4. Okay, let's press calculator. This will be uh, my calculator. 1 times 10 to the 5 times 3 times 10 to the negative 4. I've got 30 joules. Okay, so 30 joules is my answer here. If you chose the other transition up here, you will get a slightly different answer because your pressure is different. So remember, the cycle that we're looking for is from uh, there all the way to there. That is the cycle. And when we use P times delta V, we are really finding the area under the graph. So this area is a little bit smaller, but this area is the work done on guess maybe it's good to write this as a note and stick it on your wall you find it hard to visualize here's a quick cartoon to help you remember the consign conventions and what is work done on guess by guess in a2 we'll see this again okay but for now remember if you work done on guess means something outside compress the gas until the volume decrease so volume decrease associated with work done on guess in A2, we'll know that it's positive W. And then what happens if the gas suddenly expands? The gas pop like balloon explode, right? The volume increase. Volume increase means work done by the gas. The gas is doing work to push out against the environment. So associate that with the volume change, okay? And you'll be okay whether it's on gas or by gas. Okay, but anyway, that's all for this video. I think I will see you in the next one.